Hi, this is Venusian Calliope. Um, this is the fourth video of my jaw surgery break, so hey! We are now removing the smaller canvas that I painted with. And we're going to be putting in a larger one. I have gloves on, so it's okay. I don't have any paint on my hands. This is like a really lucky, like, thing to not get paint on my hands. It doesn't happen very often, but when it does, especially like twice in a row, I just feel like it's a good auspicious sign. So it's like, yes, good. But yeah, I am putting my painting to dry on a clean surface that I don't mind getting paint on. It's, don't worry you guys, it's, um, watercolor paper, so we'll be fine. I'll be fine. You know, I mean, I'm excited. So it's like, yeah. Okay, as you can tell that this larger canvas is kind of dented, but it's okay. It's okay. I mean it. I'm using the same, like, purplish, bluish, whitish glitter paint that I used from my sixth video, so, woohoo! But yeah, I'm just trying to, like, use as much paint as I can as possible, and it's like, I know it's not that like, unreasonable of a goal to, like, set. To be like, yeah, I can paint this. And just, like, I don't know. It's kind of like when you get to, like, when you're having, like, chips and salsa and then you don't have, like, enough salsa for the chips or you have too much chips for the salsa. And it's just, like, I would like to have, like, a good balance of that and I need to get better at, like, learning how to, like, manage, like, my resources because I don't really like wasting things because like you know I want things to be useful if that makes sense because I mean I just really like this color and it's like you know it's good it's good and I believe that like but like yeah I know it's going to be a little boring because I'm going to be spending like 20 minutes or so like painting in just one color, but like this is the start of my grandmother's Aurora painting and I know that I already did an Aurora painting for my mom, but like my mom, my mom is like, I like my mom. I have a good relationship with her. My grandma on the other hand, I do also have a good relationship with, I guess. But, like, it's a little more strained. Mostly because, like... We don't exactly, like, see eye to eye on everything. And it's okay not to see, like, eye to eye on everything. Like, she's just... We're two different people, and you know what? That's okay. It's fine. And not everybody is going to like you for who you are. And some people just like to, like, project, like, their own images, their own wishes onto you. And it's, it's okay. But, like, sometimes you need to, like, set boundaries between, like, yourself and, like, the people you love. And it's important to do that. But, I mean, I'm just painting a picture for her. I'm going to be fine. This is going to be fine. And I guess I should, like, mention that, like, my mom and my family finally got my uncle's ashes. So we actually have him right now. Um, it's only temporary. We're trying to, like, find a place to, like, have him buried. But, like, when we initially, like, were getting his ashes, um, 
some of the family that were like well my mom's family were really like determined to be like we'll just put him like in an unmarked spot like next to like the family plot in the cemetery and it's like you guys do realize that like uncle mike deserves like you know to be acknowledged that like he's there that he existed like you know hang on i have to take a call okay so i am back from the phone call um it's fine it was just like a reminder to like preheat the oven for like my lunch it's okay i already did that big brain time but like you know I'm a strong believer that, like, people deserve to, like, be remembered in death and in life. Especially, like, if they weren't really, like, remembered well in life. Like, my uncle was kind of my mom's family's scapegoat. And it's just sad that, like, even in death, he isn't, like, treated like he should be. And it's, like... You know, he deserved better. He really deserved, like, better than, like, what he got in life. And I'm just, like, you know, he meant a lot to me. And, like, honestly, I actually got along with my Uncle Mike more than, like, one of my mom's other brothers. I'm not going to say which brother because, like, I don't know whether or not any of them are going to be watching this video in the future. But... I see things on Facebook and sometimes it's like, especially from that side of the family, and it's like, oh, I don't like that. So I don't use Facebook for that reason for the most part. And it's like, uh, Facebook. I don't think I'm ever going to really be on Facebook as Venusian Calliope because like, ew, Facebook. Heck, I'm not even on Twitter. Well, I mean, I technically am on Twitter, but it's, like, associated with my old YouTube account that... Ew. Just no. No Twitter. Um, this is, like, going to be posted in the future, so, like, um... Twitter is basically worse than Tumblr at the moment because Elon bought it, and it's, like, just going downhill, and it's, like... It's kind of funny, but it's kind of sad at the same time, and I'm just, like... I don't know. But either way, I'm just like, eh. Yeah, the only bird app that I really use is probably Duolingo. Um, I have, I have like more than a thousand seven hundred like days of like doing it on Duolingo, like. My streak is probably, like, higher than that at the moment. But, like, I realized if I could, like, do, like, this Duolingo streak, I could probably, like, use it for, like, YouTube. And it's, like, I might as well use it. Because, like, you know, I have, like... I have, like, a lot going on, and, like, I believe in myself. And, like, I have the drive. I have the determination. Why not? Yeah. But yeah, um, I'm just like, I don't know, kind of excited. Um, I know that you guys are probably going to be like excited when all of this is over. I mean, we're at the halfway point, people. Um, we're halfway there, y'all. Yay. Only four more weeks of waiting. And then I'm, I know I'm going to be like a recovering right now and I'll probably be like around like the curve where I'm like, yeah, okay. I mean, I'm probably still going to have like swelling and stuff. I mean, I don't know. I'm not there yet, but like I will be when this is posted, if that makes sense. I'm just doing, like, a lot of, like, things in bulk at the moment. Like, you know. 
you know how it is, right? When you're, like, prepping and just, like, I feel like a squirrel, like, you know, like, storing nuts for the winter. Or I guess, like, a bear hibernating. Like, you know, like, the whole reason why, like, Fat Bear Week is, like, a thing is because, like, you know, bears have to, like, get fat and then, like, just so they can, like, have, like, enough energy so they can, like, hibernate and, like, you know, do things. Because, like, that's how, like, bears are, like, built. We aren't built like bears, though. Kind of wish we could hibernate, though, just because, like, I think it'd be cool just to, like, take, like, a nap for, like, two weeks and just be like, oh, yes, I'm finally refreshed. But I mentioned earlier that I have, like, chronic fatigue syndrome, so it's, like, you know, it's, like, hard sometimes. And, I mean, I was actually, like, formally diagnosed when I had, like, an anemia scare in 2019. So it's, like, finally some acknowledgement that, like, it's not just in my head. It's, it's real. I'm not lazy. It's just my body is just different now. And I know that, like, you know, things change and stuff. And, like, I'm just glad that I'm, like, able to, like, make videos. And I know it's not as bad as it could be. And, hey, look! I turned the canvas and, and... Come on, show my hands. Yeah, no pain on my hands. I may have, like, lied earlier to this week to my mom about, like, yeah, I don't smell paint when I do videos. Um, you know that's a lie. Like, you know that. I know that. Um, my mom doesn't need to know that quite yet. Oh, I'm using, like, scissors to, like, cut, like, this, like, piece of the canvas that it's like a string that was like attached to that canvas for some reason. And I'm like, ew, I don't want the string there. That's gross. But I'm just like doing my best to like keep everything like, you know, blue. I'm kind of like finicky when it comes to like colors. I know that like it sounds weird to be like, yeah, I'm partially colorblind, but I'm like finicky when it comes to like labeling colors. But like this is blue, right? Somebody please tell me this is blue. But sometimes blues are too green, in my opinion, especially when it comes to, like, blue paint. And it's like, y'all do realize that's green, right? Like, that's green. But, like, this is actually, like, blue to me. Like, blue has, like, like, true blue has, like, a mixture of, like, blue and purple in it for me. And it shouldn't really have, like, any, like, hints of, like, yellow or green, in my opinion, but I guess I'm kind of a weirdo. I know I must drive, like, my, like, hairstylist, like, crazy when I'm like, hey, let's dye my hair, like, a funky new color. I used to dye my hair, like, funky colors, like, way back in the day. Well, I mean, I don't mean, like, way back. I think, like, the last time I, like, dyed my hair a funky color was in 2021 or was it 2022 but anyway um I just want to like dye my hair like so like when I dye my hair purple um sometimes it like just fades out to like this pinkish color where it's like rose gold and it's like Purple is supposed to, like, you know, just stay purple. And I know it's, like, dumb to be, like, colors fade out. You can't expect, like, it to, like, stay, like, a consistent, like, you know, shade all the time. But, like, when I want, like, things to be purple, I want them to, like, just stay, like, purple. Rather than, like, fade off into, like, weird shades of, like, pink or blue or green and it's like ew I hate this I don't know I'm just like I know I'm a little weird and it's like ew but yeah um I used to dye my hair purple like a lot um for some reason I like dyeing my hair green 
Yeah, I know. Green is, like, the one color that I'm, like, yeah, this is fine when it comes to, like, dying. Because, like, you're, like, green, and then it just, like, fades. Like, it just stays, like, consistently, like, green, even though it gets lighter, in my opinion. Just, green just stays green. Or maybe it doesn't. I don't know. But yeah, um, I like green, um, my hair just likes being green. My hair just, it, okay, so, like, I've tried to, like, dye my hair, like, blue a couple of times, and it's, like, it just never, like, seems to, like, stay blue. And I know that, like, some people are, like, blue just stays in there forever, and it's, like, no, it doesn't. For some reason, my hair is just really weird where it's like you think you're getting blue but in reality it's just gonna be like this weird teal or silver and I can never like no matter how long it like stays in my hair it just can never be blue and it's so annoying And I think it's because, like, my hair probably has, like, a lot of, like, orange-ish orange -ish undertones. So it's, like, I don't know. It just, when you, like, have, like, colors that are, like, on the opposite end of, like, the color wheel, sometimes, like, they tend to, like, neutralize each other. So it's, like... When you put, like, yellow and purple next to each other, you get silver. And when you mix, um, orange and blue, you get brown. Or at least that's, like, been my experience. And also when you mix red and green, you get brown. But, like, sometimes it's, like, hard to, like, tell the difference between red and green. But, like... Anyway, my rambling aside about, like, color theory, um, this canvas has, like, dents in it, and I know I need to, like, get better at, like, purchasing canvases that don't have dents, and I need to get better at, like, you know, like, fixing it as it, like, comes along. But, like, part of me is, like, I only have this life to live right now, so I'm just gonna, like, do whatever the hell and just, you know, get it done rather than not do anything at all. So it's like, eh, I guess. But I'm just like, I don't know. I mean, I'm excited, and I know it doesn't look like the Aurora yet, and I know that, like, I don't know. I, I just, like, learned to, like, I am learning to take, like, criticism better. Especially if it's, like, you know, from a place of, like, hey, I know you can do better. Like, my dad, when I was, like, practicing, like, baking, like, the Aurora Borealis, like, in the previous picture that I did, um, the sky was a little too dark. And usually when it comes to, like, the Aurora, it, the sky kind of lights up like it is when it's, like, sunset, so it's, like, this dusky color. So, maybe it's a little too bright, but, like, I'll get there. I'll get there in the next video, probably, and then after that, I'll, like, add, like, the colors and stuff. So, hopefully, hopefully it'll be okay. And, I mean, I don't know. Sometimes I'm just, like, making things up as I go along, and that's not exactly, like, the best strategy, especially when it comes to, like, subtitling these. I I need to, like, subtitle these, and I know that, like, I don't know. It's just hard sometimes for, like, me to focus, and it's like, come on, you can do this, and it's like, no, I can't. I am tired. And it's like, but you got so many... Hours of sleep last night. I don't care. I'm still tired. I'm just exhausted all the time. And it's like... I don't know. I feel like I'm running on empty sometimes, but... I have to, like, push through. Just so that... 
I get something done rather than, like, not do anything and just feel bad. Like, I know. It's a little weird, and I'm kind of excited about, like, how this painting is going to end up. And, yeah, um... Also, tomorrow is when I'm going to be recording, like, a bunch of audio for the break. So, that'll be, like, two videos that I'll be, like, working through and just, like, you know, chilling. Doing whatever. And it'll be fine. I also got allergy shots, like, yesterday, so I'm, like... Yay! So, I know that, like, tomorrow I'll definitely, like, feel better. And, like, less congested, so. And enjoy the picture. <laughs>